Hey guys, welcome back. So in today's video, I'm going to unbox my new CyberPower uh, bat backup battery. So basically this is gonna be used for my setup back there, which is my main PC. So for the past, I believe eight years, or f even 14 years, I've never had a backup battery, such as this one. I've never had um, APC nor cyber power. I actually use a cyber power surge protector and that's all about it. So in today's video, I'm actually going to unbox this bad boy right here. This is the cyber power model. And then this is um, model number CST135UC. And this is the 1,350 uh, uh, VA, that's the output capacity, and to, uh, it's equivalent to 810 watts according to CyberPower. So the output voltage on battery is 120, plus or minus 5%, and also the output frequency is 60 Hertz, plus minus 1%. And the output waveform is simulated sine wave. It's not true, but simulated. So warranty three years I got this from Costco so yeah let's get right into it so yeah I've been running my computer my actually is a gaming computer that I built back in 2017 turning to, to 2018 uh, been using a surge protector and I've never had a true backup battery such as a backup ups or backups this thing is heavy the weight doesn't say, but it looks like about 30 pounds, I believe. So, and the packaging is it's minimal, but it protects the uh, the product. So it has. It has the styrofoam inside in all four corners. I'm just reaching out for the box right here. And this is it right here. So put it in the center. And let's read the manual later on. So this product or the backup battery a cyber power a 1350 va and it's avr it comes with the usb uh, cable but also the features that this thing has is let's go from the back and i'm just gonna read the box here so yeah this thing is heavy um, so you can see right there, put it in the center. I know my microphone is pretty bad right now with all the moving. So up front, so in the front, it has the USB type A and also you have a USB type C. So you, both the USB type A and USB type C are 4.0 amp capable. They're charging ports. And also in the front, um, the front you get a, are you, uh, not, you, get, you get a LCD, so USB threw me off and you also have your light power button and you have uh, an LCD panel up front for uh, your uh, display. And also it has a display selector up top. So when you press that, it changes the display. So on the back, it has a network protection um, I'm gonna, you know, do some uh, B-roll here so you guys can see. So uh, uh, on the back you have a uh, network protection uh, for in, and in the back you have an, uh, that network protection as well. You also have a coax cable in, in and out, and to the right you have a USB communication port. So I believe this, you plug this in to your laptop or your computer or even if you're using a NAS you can plug that in there 
uh, I have to verify that I have yet to verify but in the future uh, I'm gonna add a nest to my home setup so I can save my videos my photos all the memorabilia in that NAS I uh, don't run the NAS right now but I'm planning to get one so also in the back we have a total of one two three four five six seven eight nine ten ten receptacles five of them are surge plus battery and five of them are just surge what that means is that the surge plus battery so if you plug your computer in or your printer or your Mac once the power goes out it will default to the battery and your workstation your printer or anything that's connected to the surge battery will have a con uh, will work until the battery of the uh, the cyber power battery back backup runs out on the other hand the surge is just like your typical surge protector that you buy from uh, your electronic store such as you know, Best Buy or um, any uh, other store like out there such as circuit city back then but yeah that's the difference search plus battery is um, when you plug your computer in once a battery uh, once you uh, there's a power outage uh, your battery will uh, act as your battery source or your power source for the surge if you have something connected out there make sure that it doesn't need backup power that you're okay with uh, having a power outage uh, for that item so yeah, with that being said, uh, let's continue. Uh, it also has a wiring fault indicator in the back. It's a red LED. And you also, you, you have a circuit breaker reset. So if something happens, you press that. Uh, always refer to the manual. Uh, it says here in the back, circuit breaker, press to reset. Uh, also refer to the button of unit for electric shock cautions. Also, if you're working with uh, battery back, uh, back ups or just, you know, just APC has one as well, uh, Eaton has one as well, and also CyberPower uh, to name a few. But if you guys are working with this, make sure that uh, at least you guys read the, um, I highly suggest that you guys open up the manual booklet and read the quick how-to guide, uh, just to make sure that you guys uh, don't, you guys don't p place yourself in harm. So we're, we're just gonna do just that uh, later on. But this is, I'm gonna go read the CyberPower a manual to make sure uh, I set this up initially and correctly but with that being said um, if you guys have any questions uh, comment down below this is it right here this is for the uh, thumbnail there you go so yeah this is the cyber power uh, if you guys are just tuning in, uh, I'm buying, I'm installing my battery backup. Uh, I have the cyber power uh, with battery backup with surge protection. This is the model CSD, Charlie Sierra Tango 135 Uniform Charlie. Uh, that's CSD 135 UC. So uh, cyber power claims that it has 439 minutes of runtime and it will power and protect computers, modems, and routers, cable and satellite, game consoles such as your Xbox, PS5, uh, smart, smart home devices. I do own smart home devices such as I have one Echo. Right now he can, uh, she can hear me back there and also I own UFI surveillance cameras and also audio and video equipment that includes your home entertainment. And it's an AVR. AVR stands for Automatic Voltage Regulation. It has 10 uh, standard grounded outlets, as mentioned. And it has a 4.0 amp USB charging ports. That's the USB Type A and USB Type C, which is a plus. And also, it, it claims 1500 joules of surge protection, uh, connected equipment guarantee of $500,000, and it's a three year limited warranty. That's the model CST 135 UC at 1350 VA or 110 watts by cyber power so right now we're measuring the width is four inches and the lengthwise uh, we have 13.5 um, I would just say 14 for good measure and the height is nine and a half so in short it has a width of four inches uh, roughly about 14 um, uh, depth like if you're going uh, you know the length and the height is nine and a half inches 
so yeah this per fits perfectly in my home office right now again if you guys have any questions comment down below i'm going to read the manual charge it and then install it tonight so that's the cyber power uh, battery backup with search protection comment down below if you guys have the same thing if you have uh, experience with backup so i'll see you guys in the next video peace